run SNS Electronics. Um, the CDI box, based or ECM, has a lot of capabilities uh, with GPS track mapping. We could richen and lean fuel, obviously. Ignition timing, we can control all data. Uh, we could see and monitor oil pressure, um, coolant temps, uh, oil temps, e exhaust temperatures. Uh, pretty much monitor the whole motorcycle. And then to get even further in it, which we're starting to get to that point, have a little bit more data on suspension stuff and chassis stuff, what the motorcycle is actually doing when it's going straight, when it's entering the corner. Just to be able to monitor all that stuff gives us a better, better feedback versus making an educated guess. Yeah, it's a lot different than it used to be with your Rotexes and XR750s. It was basically just a simple ignition and uh, you had fuel and gas. We have a lot more technology nowadays. You actually have a live uh, you know, data that you can see, hey, this is exactly what the motorcycle's doing. Being able to see the data and experience it and know, hey, this is what I experienced when I was racing, didn't have this, or the bike did this, I didn't know why, even on chassis setup, but having the data to really confirm that thought process is what helps you make those decisions and be confident in what you're doing. Uh, dirt to asphalt is a lot different. It's, you know, if you miss your mark by six inches, seven inches in asphalt, it's a bad lap to where we're changing our marks by 10 feet at a time, you know, trying to find smooth ground and where, has, where the moisture is. Reading that in the data is where it becomes difficult. That's where the engineer side, because it, okay, is that a hole? Is that a wet spot that he hit that time, you know, because you're not running that same exact line. So it's hard to weed through everything and see, okay, the wheel spin up here, or was that a glitch, or what is it exactly? Um, but it just, when you get more experience, you kind of see a pattern and you realize, okay, you, that's a little minor thing. We're not gonna pay attention to that for now. Just focus on what you actually have and that you know they're doing every single lap. Electronics are gonna get better, more difficult, and uh, it's a huge key on the way that these motorcycles go around the racetrack.